Welcome explorers. Today we're gonna test out the new griddle that mounts right on the side of the Geo Pro. I started this video out in Joshua Tree Music Festival and I was camping around a lot of tents and tight quarters and I didn't really wanna be very vocal or animated that early in the morning when everybody was trying to uh, get a little R&R &R in. So okay, we're gonna make some burgers for everybody around here. Probably throw on a little salmon, check, check out some breakfast in the morning. Just put this to a real world test and see how it goes. been a few of it ask about how much clearance there is so you have about a foot of clearance see we have the hose and it just connects right down here just pop that in line gas on line gas on and So the griddle is washed and dried. I just washed it with water. I didn't use any soap. Some places say you can use a little bit mild soap, but it was brand new. I just wanted to get it a nice, uh, get any kind of coating that was off of it. Now I'm just gonna season it with a little canola oil. Right now I had this on high heat and I turned it down to about medium high just so I don't scorch everything. Some of you out there might be a cast iron seasoning pros so anybody that has good advice for this drop it down in the comments and anybody watching this take time to read the comments below and get a really good idea of, of the best methods to do this seasoning for the first time I'm gonna get a good seasoning probably several coats just kind of let it soak in wipe it off give it more let it kind of bake in and then we'll cook some breakfast on it I've heard uh, common rule is about a half hour of doing this kind of getting it really nice and seasoned get in uh, seasoning it on a hot grill I keep messing with the temperature a little bit try and do it as hot as I can right, here goes a real world test we're gonna do some bacon eggs and pancakes Again, I'm on an angle. I can show uh, you the picture of the GeoPro afterwards. The griddle seems to be very even and flush with the 90 degree angle from the camper. It's just that I'm parked on a hill, so that's why I get a little bit of the run in the eggs. Let's uh, flip this pancake and see how we're doing for evenness. Yeah. Pretty good. The middle or the center seems to just touch warmer than the edges, but I would say that's probably normal. Overall, it made a good pancake. Make a couple more pancakes. Seems to clean up pretty nice, pretty easy. Earlier at the campground, I was parked at an angle and my oil kept running this way. So I guess that's something to keep in mind. Or you can just throw a little piece of anything behind the legs there and give them a little stretch. Wild caught salmon to spruce up the meal. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So on the grill when I was cooking breakfast, I noticed there is a little bit of a center 
we're not even gonna call it a hot spot, but the, the cooking bar runs right through the center of the grill. So the center is a little warmer than the other edges, which only makes sense. But when I was doing four pancakes at a time, it wasn't to the point where the inside was gonna get burnt and the outside was gonna be raw. When I cooked it at about medium heat, I had a nice even pancake on both sides. You couldn't even really tell which uh, was the middle and which ones were on the edge. So overall, center is hotter, but it's a, it's a good cook surface. It's a great, easy cook service. You can see I'm doing little salmon and veggies today. And it's just so easy. Honestly, I don't mind if I know an area is a little warmer because now as these veggies get cooked, I can push them off to the sides here and leave my center open for anything I need a little bit warmer. My computer hard drive took a dump, so that's in the Apple store getting fixed. What I am shooting this entire sequence on is the new iPhone 11. So seems to be working out all right, and I'm gonna have to do all the editing and everything on it. So if it turns out really bad, I'll just redo the video later on and not release it. But if you're seeing one that looks pretty homemade, that's why. Now that's what I'm talking about right there.